The Daily Quirk caught up with Paulo Costanzo on the NBC Universal Upfront Carpet, and we're bringing you the exclusive interview. Season six is coming soon, right? Yeah. So, what can you tell that tell us what we can expect? Um, it's, in my opinion, the, I mean, everyone always says this, but it's, it's, I genuinely feel it's the best season we've ever done. Uh, I can say that honestly because I didn't love seasons four as, and five as much as season two, mm -hmm. and now season Sorry. six is better than all of them. Wow. So, just to validate that, but mm -hmm. uh, it's bigger, it's more epic. There's a NASCAR episode. Um, Can't wait I, to see that. I directed one just last week. Mark is directing one later in this in the season. Okay. Uh, it's just good. It's kind of firing on all cylinders. Uh, and is it starting back where season five ended? June. Oh. See, uh, see, season five ended with Hank going off with Boris uh, mm -hmm. on a, kind of a covert mission that we don't know about. He does work his way back to the Hamptons. Okay. Uh, uh, but the way that happens, I can't tell you about. But it's there's intrigue and excitement in it. Okay. And can you give us a little sneak peek of what your character is up to this season? Come on, give me something. <laughs> That's something that was fun. Uh, I will. I will say this. There's. Okay. There's a. There's a scene where me and Brooke Dorsey's character Paige, who plays my wife, mm -hmm. uh, dress up full-blown dress up like Stanley Tucci and Elizabeth Banks from The Hunger Games. Oh like, my god. Like falls out, like exactly like that. Wow. Uh, which I think people are gonna like, which was incredibly uncomfortable with the wig and they painted my teeth white. Did you have the blue hair and everything? Yes. You know, all painted white. It wasn't blue, it was like a weird auburnish, mm -hmm. but yeah. Oh, that's exciting. And what's your favorite part about playing your character? Uh, I put, he's very versatile, you know, yeah. I feel like I've done a sitcom before and it's fun to be funny all the time, but I, literally my character is kind of like the jester of the show, but also has a lot of uh, more serious things going on.